people often ask me if I had a pivotal moment where I just knew what I was going to do. I did. I had one after I'd been painting about 10 years, and it actually involved the Montgomery Museum of Fine Arts. They were down, they came, the director and the curator came down to my house to see what paintings were available for a show that I had scheduled with them. And we talked about it. I had just finished a show in Columbus, Georgia, and I didn't want to use the same paintings twice. It was too close from one to the other to do that. So we were trying to get up what I would have in three years. I mentioned to them that I had seen this little screen. It wasn't quite so little, actually, but it was very beautiful, and I was taken with it. And I left that museum thinking, I would like to paint a screen, you know, just a little screen, about four feet wide, and put it in a corner of my living room. And I told them, well, I could use that in with the paintings. And they said, that would be fine. It would be a little different. And we went on to talk about other things. And then Margaret Lynn turned to me and said, are you going to paint both sides of it? Well, that had never entered my mind. But, I, and I told her, I said, oh, no, 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 no. I wasn't going to paint both sides of it. And she said, well, I was just thinking about using it in the center of the room. That way it wouldn't take up wall space and all. And I said, no, absolutely not. So I went home and I was painting a few days later and I thought, that is ridiculous. Of course I'm going to paint both sides of it. So I called the museum, asked her if she would like for me to do that, and she said yes. So then Don and I, my husband Don, uh, moved to Maine for the summer. And I was painting up there, and I began to think about this show coming up. And I thought, you know, it would make an awfully good show if I did all screens. Now you realize I had never painted a screen. I had no idea how to paint a screen. And painting 10, both sides, for this show, it was ridiculous. But I called them up again, and I said, would you like the whole show of screens? And they said, well, that would be fine. And there I was. I did not have the vaguest idea of how to begin. But I found out how. I started on one screen one side of one screen, and it kind of evoked the, I don't know what you'd call it, but it allowed me as I painted that first side to think about what I was put, going to put on the back of it. And if I finished the back side, I could begin a different screen. And that's the way I painted. I painted every day for two and a half years. And I got that show finished. When I brought it up here, that was the first time either Margaret Lynn or Mark had seen any of the screens. Now that's what I call being trusting. But that began my painting of that series of screens, and I, when I finished it, I decided I hadn't gone quite far enough, and I painted a second series of screens, and then I called it quits. 